everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Glitter Lung Lessons. For today's episode, I'm going to be teaching you how to create a flannel pattern using markers and some tape resist here. Now, these different patterns can come in handy because you can use them as backgrounds for artwork that you might be doing to create some texture and interest. So, to get started, what I did preemptively and off camera was I took my little sheet of paper here and I took some masking tape and I went across for three and then from left to right to three, okay? So this will, when I take the tape off, leave some white spaces that I can fill in later. I also tried my best to keep everything equally apart. I don't have the tape going too far one direction or the other. And what I'm going to do is first I'm going to take the color red and I'm going to fill in all of these empty white squares and I'm going to speed up the camera to do that. those white spaces that were open red and then I removed the tape to show what's going to create the flannel pattern here. Now I'm going to take two different colors of markers. I'm going to take my gray marker and my red marker and I'm actually going to layer these to kind of create the darker shade of red that's going to go between these little cross sections here. So over here, over here, and over here, but we're not going to worry about the space where the two lines intersect. That's gonna be black in the end. Now I'll show you what I mean by layering our markers. I kind of practiced on the back here. If I put my gray down first, and then I put red over top of it, I end up getting this grayed down darker tone of red, because we can get tones when we mix gray and a color together. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna do that for all of those sections except these little middle squares where my up and down lines and my back and forth lines intersect. take my black marker and fill in all of the empty squares with black. Okay everyone, we did it. We created a very cool little flannel design here. Now this design you can use in multiple ways. You can use it to create backgrounds for your artwork or you could even use it to create um, flannel shirts for characters you create or anything like that. I'm excited to see what you do with this pattern. So go ahead and take photos of your artwork and email them to me at glitterlunglessons at gmail.com and have your artwork featured on an episode. Till next time, stay safe at home and stay creative.